What's up? It is December 11th, 320 p.m. Just landed in Salt Lake City, Utah. Snagged the rental with Pete. Welcome to another week of training. Just came <laughs> off of the half marathon yesterday with the relay team for Ironman 70.3, which was a fucking blast and a half, dude. Unreal experience. But now we're here in the mountains. We're gonna have ourselves a nice week of eating, running, lifting, Skiing, repeating. And close. Do That's basically deals. the ob objective, yeah. And we'll probably be closing a few deals as well. No, not probably. We will be closing a few deals, yeah. Who am I kidding? Um, but yeah, the legs are in for a tough time these next couple weeks. It's just juicy by your What's up, Aim? What's and up? it is tradition, as tradition shall have it. We have Chick fil A on the first night. Chick fil A on the first day. As God said. Sir, I love this. Go Do you off. love this? Dude, I love right. this. You look good. Good morning. It's currently early in the morning. Dude, and we're going skiing, baby. It's about time this guy woke We're going up. skiing, baby. Let's go, baby. <laughs> Where's Pete? Oh, he's not coming. I know. All right, dude, you gonna you ready to go shred some gnar and shred some gnar and fucking gnar and some shred? Dude, here's all I have to say. I've worked tirelessly the past year, scrolling and scrolling and scrolling watching skiing and snowboarding videos on Instagram reels. So my little thumb could scroll no more. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, dude. Hey guys, I'm here too. All right, good morning. Yo, read my sweater right now, go. I'm gonna... It's backwards. It should say, I'm fucking sending today. But it just says I'm sending today. Dude, that's what it says. And that's the truth. We Tuesday, on our hands? Like we're going later? to the slopes, baby. You wanna say that one? Is it that one? Is it that one? Dude, look at those mountains, dude. I think it snowed a little Show bit the up car. there last night. How's that for a typical rental in a typical place, John? Started off the day with 12 grilled Chick-fil-A nugs and a Red Bull straight to the bloodstream. Oh, did you get the fireballs? Dude, come on. Who do you think you're talking to right now? Right. Listen, if, if the question is ever, did Jared bring something to help us get more inebriated? <laughs> the answer is yes. All right, so the objective is quite simple today. My objective is pretty simple, too. I'm just trying to get my bearings Dude, that's, back. look at that. Look like Mariah, I'm to the Yo, eat my sweater. Dude, it's always backwards. That was pretty sick. Good that job. Was awesome. Good job. Great job. Good job. Yeah. Oh, oh, dude. Oh. Dude, I'm having a deja vu. Yeah, I'm been having a deja vu too. So there's a big hill up there. You go down, I go down following you, caught an edge, tumbled a bunch of times, and then I was just like sliding down the hill with my ski. I couldn't stop. I was just like, ah. And then my other ski was way at the top. I'm like, fuck, finally stop. And he's like, I got you. I'm like, no way. And they grab my ski, come down. I get up. I'm like, oh, I don't have my phone. Bro, don't you have zipper pockets? Yeah, I don't know why I wasn't zipped. Uh, we're Welcome to episode four of yeah. Jared Lost His Phone. What season is it? <laughs> he's in six? A few runs. We've been here since, what, like nine? So it's been about three hours. And what do you know? Jared lost his phone. The poor guy. You know, earlier he was asking to borrow an earbud so we could share. I'm like, dude, no, just can't. He's like, oh, come on, man. I'm like, dude, no. What do you know, the next run, the man loses his phone. So we're doing a little recon. We all shared our locations on this app we're using this, uh, this week called Slopes. Pretty dope app, and it tracks your location. So we think we have an estimated location of where he lost it. We know where he wiped out, but there's some lag, so we've been going back and forth. So I'm on a solo expedition here to uh, track this down. And look at that, baby! We are the that wraps up first day of skiing. 2.15, heading on out. Successful day. Pretty successful day. No right big wipeouts. No broken legs. Confidence at an all-time high. A couple runs probably left in the tank, but we're playing the long game this week, right? Oh yeah, dude. It's a marathon. And a sprint. What? A whole other plate? Yeah. Get another plate on there. Oh, oh tough, bro. Oh, my punk's stopping. I swear to you. <laughs> oh, I didn't see that one go in. Can you put your stuff back here, bud? All right, it's Wednesday, 7.30 a.m. Ski and dude, baby. you gotta turn the key all the way. I, for... Shut up, dude. Look how big this truck is. You gotta turn it. I know. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Depending on how big the vehicle is, that determines. Oh, 
determines how much you gotta fucking turn the boat. And we're going skiing. Well, I'm going skiing. He's going falling. <laughs> Dude, that was yeah, I'll that take was... it. Hey, yo, you guys love that one. <sighs> well, day two out here. I think it's safe to say that you shouldn't expect the snow. The snow conditions aren't the same every day. You can't. You gotta. You gotta assess the snow conditions before you send it. Otherwise, you end up with one of those. Dude, I ate it hard again. It's a little bit bigger than Perfect North. <laughs> yeah, it's fucking solid. I'm just fine. Dude, Jared had to keep up with me. Like, dude, it's true. Kind of shocking. It's actually. true. Me and John were chirping him. Well, not chirping him, but we were questioning him. Like, dude, listen, listen, dude. How good are you? Like, are you be able to keep dude, up? He passes with flying stars. Yeah, and yeah, by the way, the worst thing about eating shit isn't even eating shit. It's getting your skis back on. Somebody needs to teach me how to put my skis back dude, on. Dude, <laughs> you were you could you, Where you were, you can't. Dude, that I was literally, steep. ask Pete, I was laughing my ass off. <laughs> la la harder and louder than I have in a while, dude. Because I kept watching you do it. I'm like, dude, there's no way. <laughs> like, there's like a yeah. 5% chance you can get your skis on there. Like, dude, when I wiped out, when Aim got my ski, I like look at those straight. I was like, there's down. no way. Went on my butt, grabbed both skis, lifted up my feet, and just slid down to <laughs> my butt. Got That's down to great. the bottom, and then just put on my skis. Nah, just kidding. That is a wrap on day two. Heck yeah. Solid day. Definitely the biggest wipeouts of the trip occurred today. I think for all of us. Yeah. <laughs> Just biggest wipeouts, biggest jumps, top speeds. Yep. Come back tomorrow for more. What was your top speed, Jerry? 44. 44 miles an hour. Yeah. What was yours? 36. What was yours, John? Today? Yeah. 39. Uh, you didn't even break 40. I don't think I broke 40 today. Yeah, but you broke your face. Show I me, know. Show me your face. <laughs> face is it's doing okay. Soon, okay, I might bruise up. <laughs> Confidence was a bit too high this morning, I would say. Dude, that, we were on our second, like first full run. <laughs> you couldn't see anything. Uh, for, yeah, first full run. Tell. Snow is just ice. Can't see shit. <laughs> so anyway, where are we parked? I don't see our truck anywhere. Let me, let me, let me use the beeper. Oh, there it is. It is 6:30 p.m. Oh, been a long day. Just dead, man. Dad. I'm supposed to run three miles tonight. I gotta get it in. But we got back from the slopes. I wrapped up a bunch of work. And then we gotta charge the Tesla, which it's like, oh yeah, Tesla, fun, cool. Didn't consider the fact that when you're out in the mountains, there might not be a Tesla supercharger within 45 minutes of you. So when you're at 14%, you might be in some trouble. So. I don't know, I guess I gotta find out where I can hopefully charge this, hopefully you can get me there. Maybe I'll run three miles while it charges, and I wanna get to bed early, we're gonna have a long day at the slopes tomorrow. This is where training gets difficult. This is where training gets difficult, guys. It is Thursday, 7.20 a.m. Pete is ready to fucking go, baby. It's all day yesterday, got a glorious sleep, best sleep of the week. I like eight and a half hours of sleep time. Her eye is a little bit swollen. I don't know where it's gonna go, if it's gonna bruise up. Did not get a run in yesterday. But today was scheduled to be an off day, so I'll just, I'll do it today. I'll do it today, it will be A-OK. -okay. End up being a freaking wild goose chase with the Tesla last night, so it's charging somewhere right now. We're gonna go try to pick it up. Hopefully everything's still chill <laughs> and then uh we'll be out to the slopes for a long day what up uh, <laughs> you just, you're too tense i'm not tense i'm so relaxed <laughs> 12 o'clock legs are warm i guess my whole body's warm Do we have a real <laughs> no Do we it's not up we have, have it Cars, electrolytes, now I'm good for another four hours. Oh! No. Cheers! Cheers! <laughs> what up? We're up on the hill. About to launch it all the way down there. We got the cameraman, Pete, man, 10,000. Wow. 
John, what's your predictions for the day? My predictions for the day? That we have half as many runs in us as we think that we do. That's my prediction. No. What? Dude, I think we've doubled. We have as double as many runs. runs. Yeah, what are you talking about? <laughs> That's not the job I'm used to. Getting a slow start today, but we are back <laughs> for another day at the slow. That's what it really stemmed from. That is what Tuesday, is Wednesday, <laughs> Thursday, day four in a row. <sighs> We had a long day yesterday. We stayed till close. New record high number of runs, came back, and I didn't think I was ever gonna get out of that bed. Um, went over to Ames last night, had played some games, and then struggled to get out of bed today. Bring your heart into song that you ain't gonna sing. It's, it's a match made up in heaven. Like good old boys. Good old boys and beer? Dude, that is a pretty good match. And me. What up? No, just hanging out. <laughs> good morning. That wraps up day four of successful skiing. It was great. <laughs> yeah. Fantastic. Exhausted. I've had three days with 18 plus strain a day in a row. I think we hit a 12. I think I had 12 runs today. We sent PRs everywhere, baby. It's night time and we got a real problem on our hands. Huh? For the vlog? Yeah. Nice. You're in the vlog now too. What do you got to say to the, the vlog? Roll tide, motherfucker. <laughs> I'm just got my new hat. Okay, so it's been five minutes since the last update. And in the last five minutes, we walked from the parking, from the parking garage to here. And uh, we're in a pretty fancy spot. And me and John are gonna have a drink off. One for one? Yeah, one for one. That's so mean. Sunday, 1026, and we're gonna have ourselves a little run. Oh wait, actually, we got some gloves. It's a little chilly out, but I've not been running this week because of how much skiing I've been doing. Been in vacation mode, you could say. So today, Sunday, normally an off day, but we're gonna come out and we're gonna rip a little 10 miler. Now the hard part about running somewhere new is you gotta find a sidewalk. Ideally a trail, but all we're looking for today is a little sidewalk. A little sidewalk would go a long way. We are 2.6 miles in, and I am dead. Oh, I am dead. Just been trying to get to the mountains. All right, we're making our way up. A little ways to go, we popped out on the freeway. Man, my legs are toast. Those are some hills, I'll tell you. I hate running on the freeway. Don't recommend it. You don't feel the safest, but that's where I ended up. Seven miles in. It is so cold. We got way colder. And it is so windy. And I'm on the freeway, so I gotta find a three mile track to get back to civilization. All right, that is 10 miles complete in an hour 36. Had a nine, 37 minute per mile pace. Solid freaking run. Like, one of my, for sure, most unique, memorable runs to date. Towards the mountains, up the mountain, into some neighborhoods, on the freeway, all over the place. First time I've ever just run 10 miles out somewhere, or really any distance out somewhere, and then just Ubered back, which is really cool. I could explore way more. I didn't have to memorize the route. I could just go get lost. And then, what, well, paid a couple bucks for somebody to just drive me back to the house. It's a good reminder to like challenge the way that you typically train and do things, right? It's like, why would I have to just run back? Because that's the way I've always done things. But the run was so much better 
more fun, more enjoyable as a result of just breaking the standard. Glad I didn't hit the treadmill. Glad I pushed through. That's uh, another week of training. Um, definitely a down week. Next week we'll be back up because we're out of vacation mode. So just going to go slam some food, rest the rest of the day. December 17th, 7.15 p.m. We're coming into the end of the year, reflecting on our previous years and planning out our goals for 2024. And I believe that Jared invited me to pull out the camera so he could share one of his goals for 2024. That's just not how this happened. <laughs> But I love uh, that you gave me the power behind it. Did this goal on him? No, I I love that actually. It's on my goal list. Let's pull it up real quick. 2024 goals: health, run a full marathon. And so we're signing up right now to go run a marathon in I don't know Eugene, Oregon. Eugene, Oregon. What if we both die? <laughs> yeah, we are. Right. What a marathon way to go. estimated time. What am I gonna go for? I'm gonna go for a three, three fifteen to three twenty probably. Oh, done. We're ready. Done. Can you type in my number that fast. Yeah, dude. I'm a yeah. expert. Trust me, dude. <laughs> Trust me, dude. I'm, I'm a credit card typer and an expert, dude. You need a credit card typed into a fucking payment channel, dude. Call me out. <laughs> We're in, baby! The road to sub three continues. And I talked about this before, but it was kind of weird. Yeah, turn off the music. Yeah, we can't, yeah, we can't upload any of that. Yeah, hey, you're the, you're the content master, man. You should know these things. Well, I thought it was fine, and then you really cranked it up after I <laughs> let it go, and I didn't think about it again. After all your recording. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. sorry, sorry, future John, for the extra scrubbing. Actually, you know what? Fuck you, yeah. future John. What are you Fuck doing you, right future now, John? John? <laughs> yeah, dude. I like current John better. <laughs> we have a falling out that hits home. You see that? You start crying. <laughs> dude, all right. No, you can't fake the celebration again. Yeah, we can. <laughs> dude, come on. We're YouTubers now. All right. And there we go, baby. Let's, Let's go. go. <laughs> dude, you can't laugh. You got to be. Okay. All right, let's go. One more time. All right. <laughs> and boom. We're in, baby. Let's go. <laughs> we are officially registered for the Eugene Marathon, April 2024. All right, hello. It is Wednesday, 4.45 p.m. Woo! Wrapped up a day of work and we are heading to the slopes, baby. Let's go. Which slopes? We're we're heading to Pow Powder City. Powder That's Mountain. Right. Powder Mountain. Wow. Iconic. Woo! <laughs> Listen, there's two rules to night skiing. You drink. And you, and you go really fast. You ski, yeah. you ski fast. Yeah. Is that the answer? Yeah. What's the answer? No, you got it. Oh, okay. Um, so come on, you, you eat this. food? No. <laughs> no, no, dude. Come on. Okay, what was it again? I'll give you a hint. All right, let's go. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> let's go. That was crazy. Let's go. The what? Let's go. That lift was crazy. Oh yeah, this one? Match you. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Damn. Here's John here, hopping on the treadmill and ready to kick off another week of training. Well, another short week of training at that. It is Thursday, December 21st, 9.17 p.m. And it's the first run of the week. So why is it Thursday? I'm just having my first run of the week. Oh, I've been skiing. Legs have gotten plenty of work. And I've been pretty wrecked, to be honest. So, just been taking it easy. So we're gonna knock out a quality session today. Six miles with some intervals. And watch the people climb these rocks. Hey man, we out here in Slut Lake City <laughs> with the boy Jay Rock. <laughs> what we got, up? We got John Deasy in the background. Papillon. Papillon. And we're about to go get some fucking clips 
shredding up at Brighton with the boys, drinking some beers. Our grandmas will be proud. Oh yeah. Let's oh, do yeah. it. Oh yeah. <laughs> Found it. Dude, this guy should fucking be a YouTuber, dude. <laughs> Noggin. Noggin, hold on. <gasps> we are at a new location. Ooh, new location. New we location new. alert. We love new locations. Yeah, baby! I can feel the rage already! Can you guys? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, guys. We're gonna smash some stuff. What's up? Welcome back to Ohio. What's up, dude? It's Sunday, December 24th, otherwise known as... Christmas Eve. And to round out one of the shittiest weeks of training ever, we're gonna go get a little lift in. Are you lifting today on Christmas Eve? Oh boy. Come on. Come on. Sloppy. 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 